Hello, my adoring public. This is God Love Breath. Let me take a bow over here and a bow over there. And the crowd goes wild. Woo! Yeah, all right. Woo! Woo! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm done. Anyways, today I wanted to talk about, or rather, seven hours from the last blog that I did, which was pathetic, uh, to, I want to talk about abridged anime series. And for those of you who don't know what this current kind of phenomenon is, it's basically something that was a concept created by Little Karibo, which is to take an anime, episode by episode, like, bring it down to a, the very essence of what it is, and make fun of it. In Yu-Gi-Oh! The Abridged series... What they do is that they do a basic summary of the episode for the most part. You know, there's alterations all over the place to make it funny. But it's about four or five, each episode's about four or five minutes long, or at least when it started out it was. And all the dialogue is redubbed. He throws in weird musical cues and everything. But the plot is mostly the same. Mostly. And it's kind of interesting, and it was very, very funny when Little Karibo, <laughs> when Little Karibo did this particular concept. It was very original. No one had really done anything quite like it in dubbing before. Probably somebody had on YouTube or something, but it had never been done so well. And now it's become this sort of phenomenon where every almost every guy on YouTube has his own little abridged series. It's something that has almost begun to... It's beginning to annoy me to a certain extent, and I'll give some specifics why. I'm not saying that if you have an abridged series, shut it down, you know, delete it because it's unwanted or anything. But I'm beginning to notice that people tend to throw in the abridged series thing just to get views, even if it isn't really within the abridged series mold, or even if it's one of the huge things for me was that I was cruising around the other day. I was looking at Excel Saga videos since I was... I've been re-watching Excel Saga, and that show is... It is the absolute most hilarious anime, like, period. I love that freaking show. I'm beginning to realize how much of it went right over my head the first time I watched it, which is, I think, like two years ago now. Now that I'm re-watching it, I'm revisiting it, there's all these little anime gags that I didn't get before. All these little in-jokes, all these little parodies. But I started cruising around for videos for Excel Saga, and I noticed that there was an Excel Saga bridge series. Now, why would you make a parody onto something that's supposed to be a parody? It, it, I can understand you're a fan of the source material and everything, but the entire point of an abridged series is that you're taking something that's mostly serious, like something like Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's face it, it's taking itself pretty seriously. These card battles are pretty intense when you watch the show. Not intense in a natural sort of way, but the characters are kind of staring at each other like, I'm going to kill you with my blue-eyed white dragon. And the other guy's like, oh yeah, Kaiba? Well, I'm going to blow you up with my stink bomb of stinkiness. It is a really awesome card because it stinks. You see, and this is why I don't do a bridge series, because I would suck at it so bad. But the whole thing that was so interesting about Little Karibo's creation is that it was unique and it was original. I think a lot of people are just kind of riding the bandwagon at this point. And there's a new abridged series coming out every week or so. And sometimes, in the case of like Neon Genesis Evangelion, there's like six or seven abridged series out there. Last time I checked, which is only about, I would say a year ago, I remember there's like three different abridged Evangelions. I bet there's more now. But I remember watching each one of them, and none of them were very good. It's... Okay, if you're going to do a dub... I would suggest, I think, for me personally, you gain a lot more respect by not throwing up the abridged thing just for the, oh, look, it's Evangelion, the abridged series, just like Naruto, the abridged series, and just like Yu-Gi-Oh, the abridged series, and all the other abridged series that are actually worth watching. It's become, I understand, it's a fan connection sort of thing. When you when you make an abridged series, you become a part of of the abridged series community. And there is actually a community of people who do parody videos based around this particular construct, this particular concept. Ah, I just, 
I just don't know. It seems so stale now. If you're going to do a dub, I would suggest really thinking about it. Really trying to find something fresh because it's really, unless you're little Karibo, and even his videos are starting to get boring. It, they're not, it doesn't have the freshness it did anymore. You can't just come in and parody something half acidly with whatever crazy dialogue you come up with and have it be funny. I've done it before. It turns out horribly. We all know that sort of, I think a lot of anime fans at one point or another have created fan dubs and have looked at them and went, my God, that's like the crappiest ass thing you could possibly do because they're fun. I did a few and I labeled them as the worst possible fan dub you could possibly imagine. That way I could get away with it and say, see people, see, I'm not taking myself seriously. I'm just an asshole out here, basically. Ooh, I said a really bad word. I'm, I'm a jerk there. There, now I've censored it because I've followed it up with another word that's not quite as bad as asshole. And now I've said asshole again. I need to really stop saying asshole. Shit, I just said asshole, didn't I? Oh, now I've said shit. Oh, okay, so anyways, back to the abridged... <laughs> back to the abridged series. I just don't know what to make of this. I don't know what to say. I just want it to stop. Just please, let it go. Find some other thing to make your dub fresh. Don't just rip off Little Karibo. Don't just rip off the Little Karibo rip-offs, which is rather strange to say, but it's a very true thing that's going on. This is just becoming... You're wearing it thin. You're sort of making this a trivial sort of thing. Little Karibo's creation, Yu-Gi-Oh! The Abridged Series, should stand as its own little thing. It shouldn't be... I've talked to some people who don't even realize that Yu-Gi-Oh! The Abridged Series was the original Abridged Series. And to me, that's shameful when people actually think Naruto The Abridged Series was the original. And Naruto The Abridged Series, I'm sorry, sucks. It does. You can attack me. Whatever. It sucks. I've seen a couple of episodes. It doesn't have the wit. It doesn't have the strength of writing. It doesn't have the timing that Little Karibos a bridge series did. All right, so with that said, I don't know what my point was towards people who make a bridge series because, you know, continue doing what you're doing. It's fun. I, I get that. It's just I wish there wasn't such a huge overflow of it. This is Gotta Love Breath, and I am signing out.